Hey guys, I'm Big Kev, and this is Seven Days to Die. Welcome back. And real quick, if you're new to my channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button. And if you enjoy the videos, make sure you slap that thumbs up button while you're at it. So I've done a lot of work off cam. Um, technically, it wasn't off cam. Uh, I recorded it as a kind of behind the scenes video. And basically, it was just me building up the wall and uh, upgrading my fort a little bit. So uh, we're heading back now. We'll take a look at that. Um, that video, I didn't think me building a wall would merit its own video. Um, that's why I kind of, I, I guess it's a part of this series and at the same time it's just kind of, you know, I'm sure there's people that might want to see that. I'm sure there's people that don't want to see the mundane details and crafting. Um, but it's there. If you want to see it, go check it out. Um, for now, it's in the same playlist as my series. I may actually make a separate playlist. I'm not sure yet. But, uh, yeah, this is what I've got done so far. And let me get up here. Okay. So this is what I've got done. Um, all the way around, we built a wall. And I need to start concrete production and that's what we're going to be working towards today uh, I actually want to go track down some parts and build the cement mixer and uh, there's a couple things I want to button up on this Ford as well I'm gonna turn this ramp into stairs I'm not sure if it makes much of a difference but I'm gonna do it just for the looks and uh, real quick I just wanna see how much wood I have here I need to eat first so let me do that much better to work on a full stomach all right that'll do for now but I just want to button up not all of it just some of it um, just some stuff I couldn't reach man I really hate when I do that that's one thing about the hammer as fast as it is it's easy to make mistakes but oh well so what I'm gonna end up doing once I get all this filled in is I'm going to well actually I don't know if I'm gonna fill it all in yet or not I'm trying to decide what to do because underneath here I have all this space um, so I don't know if I should just leave this surrounding edge open but the problem with that is once I put my bars up um, as a ledge to keep the spider zombies out n not much is gonna get inside uh, so maybe I could get rid of these spikes and turn this into my garden I don't know we'll see I'm gonna leave this platform as it is for now just in case I decide to do that I, I just feel like it's kinda of pointless to block all this off and not use the bottom so with that being said and we're done with that let's see what we need for the cement mixer okay so forged iron 25 that's not a problem scrap cable spring we need a small engine and I still want to find a better engine for my mini bike so let's see what we have in here the forged iron isn't gonna be a problem I don't think let me see here crank this up 25 and how about some fuel okay so that'll be that uh, springs plenty of springs we have the scrap cable so I think all we need is a motor right and pipes I'm sure we have tons of pipes right yeah okay so all we need is a motor 
I think I'm going to grab a wrench. If I don't already have one, I need to clear my inventory out. So, I ended up finding a flashlight too. I think we'll stick that on our pistol. Uh, assemble. And slap that on there. And now what we'll do is we'll go ahead and wear our helmet. So let me just clear out my inventory real quick here. Don't need most of this stuff. I'm going to put these gas cans in my... Um, oh, there's my wrench. I'm going to put those gas cans in the bike. Mm, I'm at a 9mm ammo. Huh. Am I? Yep. So we'll make some more of that before we head out as well. Let's just throw all this stuff in here. Put these away. And my building supplies. We're going to have to get a lot of sand and uh, a lot more stone as well. Let's see. Throw that up there. And we'll throw these in there for now. So we need some bullet casings. Take some more tips and gunpowder. And we'll make some 9mm rounds. Now see, that's the bad thing. You see that zombie in the background there. Um, and I think that's the end of that. I don't know where he went. Well, what we're going to do is get rid of these for now. Where is that guy? I hear more. There we go. You need to respect other people's stuff. Okay. Oh, look at that. Another pistol. We'll take a look at that in a second. Wow, now that's a pistol. Nice. Alright, so what I'm going to do, we're going to head into the hub city and see if we can find another motor. So I'll see you as soon as we get there. Actually, you know what? It's almost nighttime. So I think I'm just going to um, straighten up my inventories and first thing in the morning, we'll head out. Okay, guys, so I did a little bit of prep work. Um, if you look, I took down the railing. I think I finally figured out what I'm going to do. I actually think I'm going to enclose the bottom area and I'm going to remove both of these ramps and both of those doorways. And I'm actually going to put a sort of a garage underneath. And um, I feel kind of weird about planting a garden underneath. But I definitely feel like I want to enclose this all. Um, realistically, you wouldn't have a garden inside a closed room. And I don't know, maybe it might not grow with me doing that. But I think I'm going to try it anyway. And what I'm going to do on a certain level, every so often I'm going to put a couple of um, iron bars, uh, sort of like windows. So on horde nights and whatnot, I can come down and basically um, just start popping melons. But to stay on task for now, 
I'm going to head back to Hub City and we're gonna look for some motors got my wrench we're ready to go and uh, we'll see you over there as soon as I get out of this ditch that I dug and now regret that I can't get out of okay so that's a pain I think if we just take this one down I should be able to get out and again I apologize for my voice I'm a little under the weather got a pretty nasty head cold right now so I'm sure I sound kinda funky there we go okay on to Hub City okay so I've made it to Hub City um, as opposed to getting all these cars sitting out in the open I'm trying to see I don't remember if there was a car lot here or not so I'm just running around real quick trying to see I, I believe there is one but we'll just take a little spin through town here and see what we could find and I definitely need to remember that place is there I can come back and get a lot of iron which we're gonna need because uh, of course we have to upgrade our walls to iron before we can upgrade them to concrete and now that I think about it now that I've actually said that out loud I did have all those rebar frames that I meant to use for that that wall and I forgot about it but it's too late for that now I don't know. I, I'm going to have to think about that because that could save me quite a bit of iron. I don't know. We'll see. Where? Maybe there's not a car lot. Let me, uh, let me jump off here real quick. Check this map out and see. Car lot. That's the hotel, I believe. Hmm. Is that the hotel? Apartment complex, I should say. That is a bank. This right here. This might be it. Okay, so let's go have a look. I like my armor. That's pretty slick looking. Kind of crazy. I wouldn't mess with a dude dressed like that. Here we go. Jim's cars. This is what we're looking for. So hopefully we can find some half decent motors. I don't see anybody creeping around. Oh. Nope. I think that's brighter than my uh, mining helmet, actually. I like that. All right, let's get to work here. Oh, there he is. You know, just for the sake of not drawing a crowd, just kind of take him out quietly. There we go. Not that this is going to be quiet anyway. Oh, there's a motor. Was it really that easy? Alright. If they come, they come. We'll take care of it. What was that motor I got? A 320? Well, since we're here... dead yeah since we're here we're gonna keep going just because um we need the iron anyway and hopefully we can find a a better motor for the mini bike actually what do we have on the mini bike right now where to go there it is we have a 301 so this one's already better 
I'm not going to change it right now because if we need to get out of here, I don't want to have to fuel up again. I definitely want to finish these cars out, though. They're still hunted, so they're going to come. There they are. Probably shouldn't have fired the gun, but that's all right. That's why we got armor. Okay. All right. Still on the hunt. And there's a motor. Now we're talking 410. That's a lot better. All right. Um, I think we have everything we need. I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to break down these cars off cam. And then I'll see you back at the house. And we'll make our cement mixer. All right. So we've made it back home. And I'm starting to think I probably shouldn't have taken that railing down just yet. But that's okay. So I put the... 410 motor on my mini bike so my quality is 420 my durability is 3708 uh, doesn't seem to have changed my speed or noise I'm not sure if you can get over 10 meters um, I don't know we'll have to see because eventually we're gonna get better stuff um, but we'll see we'll see when we get there I got plenty of motors I don't think I need all of them so we may scrap them I'll probably hang on to at least one though um, but we should have enough for our cement mixer let's see oh I need my cable and my iron and that should be everything I need let's see there it is. Okay, so that's going to take a minute and a half. So like I said, we're going to... Um, I'll probably go... I'm thinking three high with the concrete. Yeah, about three high. I think what I'm going to do first, though is inside I'm gonna go ahead I'm gonna clear out some of the spikes on this corner and I'm gonna I'm gonna remove both ramps I'm gonna remove both doorways and I'm gonna put a vault door down in this corner um, right here leading into a sort of a garage um, yeah that's the best way I can think to do it. I'll be able to drive the mini bike through it. Um, I'm going to make it a little bit bigger inside. Uh, just so I can turn it around a little easier. And then we'll have another door going into the inside with either a stairway. Or a ladder coming up into the main. Uh, up into the house here. But yeah, I'm going to wrap that episode up here. If you enjoyed the video... Make sure you hit that like button, and like I said before, if you're new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching, guys.